Before we begin the video, if you haven't yet, come on down and join my Discord server. Link is down in the description. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel for another set haul video. So recently I ordered the season 14 sets from Target and they came in the mail today. So I guess what we're going to be doing is just another one of the set haul videos. So yeah, let's take a look and see what is inside this box. So first up is going to be the Jungle Dragon or Zippy as he's known. And let me turn this around. Uh, this is a really cool set. Originally I was debating if I was going to get this set or not, but actually I, I really like it. Um, I have to be honest though, this box art is not the best. It's a bit cluttered, but from the actual images I've seen of this set, it's really good. And I think the head details are pretty nice, although the tongue, uh, it's different for Ninjago Dragon, but, you know, no real issues there. And it looks like you also got some of the keepers. You've got the two-headed guy. And let me just say this box art, as usual, looks fantastic. And this comes with Zane. This is exclusive for Zane, I think. Uh, Lloyd, the, I think, Thunder Keeper or Rubble Keeper. And, um, yeah, this guy, the two-headed guy. So, yeah, this is a cool set, and let's take a look at the next one. Okay, so our next set is going to be a much smaller one. This one is called Lloyd's Jungle Chopper Bike. And, actually, I have to say this is a pretty good bike, you know. It's smaller, but I think this is actually a very good quality here. This kind of sail with his symbol on it and with other little patterns or designs. So yeah, yeah, I think this is a pretty good set. I also like the colors. You've got some green there, darker green here, and of course, uh, I guess these fangs or spikes up there and some gold on the wheels and over here. And uh, yeah, I mean, this is a smaller one, but as far as bikes go, this one actually is, you know, maybe one of the better bikes we've seen from Ninjago, especially for, what is this, a $20 set? And um, yeah, last but definitely not least, last but probably best actually, is going to be the Keeper's Village set. Let me spin this around. This is easily the best set of the wave in my opinion. It's really, really good. I, I really like how this is a location-based set in the same way, I guess, that the Skull Dungeons are. You know, this is, I guess what we got here is, at first it's kind of just like a beach. There is some um, vegetation and trees. And then it transitions into the actual Keeper's Village. Here are the still golems. Here is that animal-like, I guess, mount that we see in the show or in the trailer. And then here is his throne and the chief and just some other various stuff here. Yeah, this is a very good set in my opinion. And I am really excited to build this one. Uh, but yeah, that is going to be about all for this set haul video. As I always do, I do plan on live streaming for all three of these sets. So we'll probably do those over the next week. Hopefully we will start off with the Jungle Bike tomorrow. And then after that, of course, after the season ends, probably some set reviews. And uh, yeah, hope to see you guys at the live streams. It's going to be fun. Thank you for watching, guys. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, share with anyone and everyone you know. Share your thoughts on your favorite season 14, the island sets below. And I'll see you guys next time.